Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's currently a Wednesday. It's just after eight o'clock. I woke up at half seven, contemplated going back to sleep. <sighs> after only like three hours and 15 of sleep. But honestly, I'm hoping that the lack of sleep from this night will help me go to sleep tonight. And honestly, yeah. However, it didn't help. I was still up till two finishing an assignment. But anyway, since I woke up, I did some reading of Headhunters by Jonas. I only read like 30 more pages, but I've read something. Like, I've read some more. So, I'm gonna get up gonna have a coffee for the first time in a long while iced coffee though but i'm gonna have a coffee nonetheless and honestly yesterday i wrote a to-do list i don't think i completed much on my to-do list from what i definitely know i finished one thing and that was because i did that the night before so yeah but I want to go through that list, <sighs> see whether I actually did anything yesterday. There is definitely one thing I know I can tick off and that's the assignment that I completed this morning. I know I can tick that off, but anything else, yeah, I'm not sure. But even though I've got college today, lessons are support lessons because i've now finished learning all the content and so it's just time to work on assignments like now and just yeah but they want everything they want us to have everything in by i think it was like the 14th so that they can get it into the final grades into cash by the 21st like for the 21st so yeah so it's just a re it's just focused on getting assignments done resubs done all of that good stuff and just getting assignments through i won't be being set any more new assignments luckily it is literally just completing first submissions of like a third assignment in a unit or doing resubs but I'm not going to be set any more new ones so that's obviously great it's beneficial which does also mean that by the end of May I will be free like I will be free and yeah because it's like it's the 21st of April, so in a month's time, I will be finished with everything. And honestly, that's just so <sighs> great. Yeah, it's just so, so great. And just, yeah. So it's like the final countdown. But I've got like three weeks. No, yeah, I've got about three weeks to do stuff. So I just need to get on with stuff. I have got resubs to do. The last of first submissions are only due in like next week. And so they, teachers will need to have a quick turnaround on those. But I do obviously need to make sure that I just do really well on them. So I don't have a resub. But if I was to have a re But even still, teachers need to have a quick turnaround on marking. But I'm going to get out of bed. And try and make myself look a little bit more presentable. Okay, so I am now back from my walk. Well, I've been back from my walk about... 10 minutes ish but i was getting breakfast because i woke up and i went for a walk like i didn't drink anything didn't eat anything 
I just wanted to go for a walk and also because I didn't want to need a pee and if I drank water I would have needed to pee likely especially because it's not like warm outside so because it's like slightly chilly not good but I've now got back obviously because you all recognize the bed if you've watched my channel before but if not then hi I'm glad that you've found this video and I just had some like Tesco's own like shreddies you know those type of things you know the cereal that Nana's knit yeah that cereal and I just had and then I had a banana and I've just drank some water mainly because in my mind I've had the whole motto of drink more water because I have been listening to the drink more water podcasts from Sophie Miller and Riley Dixon or Sophie Jane on YouTube and I think Riley Fit on YouTube. I could be getting Riley's YouTube name, not quite right, but I love both like women. They, I love the Aussie accent, like they're Australian. So if you're a fan of the Aussie accent, go check it out. Cause honestly, it's oh and they talk about some good stuff like they talk about finances in a relationship i know that this week they're going to be talking about fitness because when i suggested stuff for a podcast last week sophie replied like saying they'd already had some like plans to talk about fitness for like this week's podcast and so the stuff i'd suggested would fit nicely into that so oh can't wait to watch that episode but I've absolutely been loving that so if you're wanting to get into a podcast that doesn't really talk about a specific topic but talks about some good topics go check it out and let me know how you find it and so yeah because I've still got my shoes on I'm just going to empty my bins because that is on my to-do list my to-do list I created yesterday, but typically this is like a usual thing where I'll create it like the day before, but we'll complete it actually over like a few days. Honestly, it's a problem, but as long as it doesn't harm anybody, I'm okay. So I'm going to empty the bins because they do need emptying, especially my recycling, because I always fill that up so, so quick, but I'll do that and then it'll probably I was about to say it'll probably probably be about time for me to start setting up for a lesson or at least like registration anyway but then I thought actually it might be a little too soon for that so honestly honestly I don't know but in that time I maybe might be able to like finish up on a video because I got everything ready I just never scheduled it so I just need to schedule a video so that will go live tonight because obviously today I said it's Wednesday and I try and upload on a Wednesday and Sunday but sometimes I miss the odd upload but I always try and upload on those days so <clears throat> even if you miss like even if I miss like a Sunday I will always try and get that video up for the Wednesday however sometimes I do just upload that Sunday video on a Monday it all depends on the mood I'm in and whether I've got content already edited or almost finished edited or filmed or whatnot. So there is that. But I'm actually going to read my list that I created yesterday. There are some things that have been ticked off. Remember, there was one thing that was crossed off. Like I wasn't going to attempt it today. But I put empty bins. I put research assignment four which i did finish last night technically this morning it was like almost two then cpd assignment four that's due in today i've done a li i stuck in a little bit on each like subheading just so that i had like a basis to go off for like today but because it's support sessions i should be able to finish that for the five o'clock deadline i had originally put yoga but i've just crossed that off i'll I'll 
attempt like yoga another day i just sort of want to like for me going on a walk was like a big thing it was only like 0.8 miles but still and well it was 0.8 miles because i decided to like time my walk on fitbit and i can't i don't know what time it was but it was 0.8 miles <clears throat> And then I put walk, so that's already been ticked off. Then I put upload vlog. I did originally think I was going to sort that out yesterday. Because I was thinking, should I just upload it yesterday? Like yesterday, I was thinking, should I upload it like that day? But I decided to wait. So I just need to schedule that. I had originally put record final part of Sims 4 redo list. But on the to-do list... Basically, I put this to-do list into, like, Apple Reminders, and I'm going to tick through that there. And on that, I haven't put that in, just because I'm probably going to be working on, like, a different assignment tonight. So, I don't want to, like, have to worry about that. I might do some editing on the footage that I already have for that video, but I don't think I'm going to have enough time... Or like free time or like daylight time to or just like time when I'm going to be able to talk slightly louder I'm not gonna have that today so that won't be a thing that's today hang up clothes I actually did that the night of the 19th technically the morning of the 20th so that was one that I got to tick off straight away then I put tidy room yeah it will happen as I sort stuff out. Put away books. Which, because basically my nana had a few books that she'd finished reading. So I brought them back with me when we went to visit her. And so I needed to put those in my bookcase. So I've done that. That was done like... That was done at the same time as when I hung, hung up the clothes. And then drink more water, which was based off of the podcast. So that's my to-do list. That's some of the stuff I aim to get done. If I don't get any of the Sims 4 episode done, then I'll be okay. Just because... <laughs> Honestly, it'll just be okay. Like, I can afford to, like, not edit it today, if that makes any sense. And, yeah, it's a simple to-do list. Yes, there's quite a few things on it, but some of those tasks are small, so that does help. Like, for example, going for a walk, it probably only took me, like, 15 minutes, so, therefore... <clears throat> It was a simple thing, like it didn't take up much. Or like, empty bins, that's not going to be a big thing. Hang up clothes, that wasn't a big thing. When I put away books, that wasn't a big thing. Drinking more water, that's not a big thing. So, there's a few little things on my list, which is what bought it out. But, there are obviously a few slightly bigger things. And also, going back to the whole smaller things, because I'd already done everything else on, like, the vlog that I'm going to upload. Like, I've already done the thumbnail, I've already done the editing, I've done the description, everything. I just need to schedule it. So, that is literally just a, like, a clicker button thing. So easy to do. And that's the thing. Make sure you, if you want your to-do list to look, like, nice and fulfilling put some easy tasks, put some like simple tasks on and then put like the odd harder task on that's going to be more time consuming or just more time consuming rather than harder something because something could be quite time consuming but not hard but anyway I will get on with the emptying my bins and I'll probably join you later in the day once I've done like some assignment work Okay, so now I know I said I was going to talk back to you guys after I'd done assignments. It, I haven't. But I wanted 
I have done the bins. But I wanted to mention something I mentioned in the first clip. I said that I'll go downstairs and have a nice coffee. I've not had any coffee and I'm currently feeling okay. Might need one at lunch, but I'm good. If I've mentioned this already in the last clip you viewed, then oops. But I just wanted to mention that, like I've not had any coffee at the moment and I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. Only got like 3.15 of sleep, but I'm feeling all right at the moment. I'll probably crash later tonight though, but overall, I'm good. Like, I'm good. So, yeah, I'm good. And I, I don't know whether it's just like having done a walk, fresh air, food or whatnot, or just the fact that I've now given my body time to wake up, but I'm not as in much need of a coffee as I was to start with. So, goes to show that you don't actually need a coffee if you're feeling like a little bit tired in the morning. Like, you can wake up more yourself. So, there is that. And I will get on with doing some work. Well, first I'll schedule the video, then I'll get on to do some work. So, my to-do list is definitely being ticked through, like, good feeling. I'm in a positive mood, I might not be in like two hours, but I'm running with this positive mood whilst I still have it. It is now 20 past three and I have finished an a different assignment on my list. So I no longer have any more assignments on today's list. I do have more assignments that I can be getting on with and also resubmissions as well. So I have an assignment due in Friday so I think what I'll do is I'll make like a small start on it like I might do like a little brain dump or something or like I might look at the information that it says in the textbook look at that dump some words on the page so that at least I can say I've started it and also so that then I've got something to build off of that's something that's always very very handy is just to like brain dump something However, I have got a bigger, bigger, like a bigger assignment due in Monday that I haven't started. Technically Sunday night because it's due in at 9 on Monday. So, technically Sunday night. But I have an assignment due in then. So, I could also start on that. But I kind of feel like that's more of a weekend task. Because I don't really want to be getting on with it right now. Like, honestly. I've just submitted an A-style criteria assignment. I doubt that I'll get it first time. I've probably not done what the criteria is asked. But I've definitely made a good attempt at it. And so... I think I'm gonna brain dump on like the assignment, a document for the assignment due in Friday and yeah I might set up like a document for the assignment due in Monday so with like all the subheadings so at the very least I've got it there or I might do like a PowerPoint I don't know I'll probably originally pull it as like a document to start with but I feel like if I do that then it will mean that I sort of know what I need to do and if I want to like just go on and do like a little bit tonight I sort of can I could like cherry pick a few like different subheadings and do a few different subheadings or like just do like two at the moment and then focus more on it at the weekend like I could do that and I do have the time freedom to be able to do that I do have assignments due next week that I haven't 
necessarily started and also resubs for next week that I haven't started so my main focus is get the stuff for Monday um, for f the assignment for Friday and the assignment for Monday done because I, then I've got fri lessons Friday like the day of Friday not the day of Friday the day of Monday the day of Tuesday to get in like to do like resubs and that other assignment that's due in but at the moment I'm not too stressed like last night I was stressed for the assignment that actually I don't need to hand in till Monday like technically I needed to hand in two assignments this Monday this coming Monday but originally I think she was confusing her words so I originally thought it was due for, for like today so I stressed to get it done for today but because I don't have to be have it done for today I might add on like a little bit more but I should probably make like a list of what's like coming up first that is outstanding and then go from there so that is my update I have drunk probably close to about and I've drunk close to a litre of water so far which is certainly more than like the past week combined unfortunately it is a few hours later it is dark outside and it's currently 10 to 10 so that's a good I last talked to you at like was it like something past eight I can't remember I actually can't remember is it was it something past six I really can't remember but I almost fell asleep not gonna lie I've had no coffee which I'm kind of proud about in the sense of yeah I have had coca-cola though so I have had some caffeine in me but I am definitely tired <sighs> but yeah I had done some assignment work. I hadn't started the big one that's due in Monday. I did do a little bit on one that's due in next Wednesday though. So I feel alright about that. And I did do a little bit on the one that's due in Friday. So I've done some more assignment work. But I'm not going to do any more today. And also probably because I feel like I'm too tired to do that. Like my work is probably not going to be the greatest. Honestly, I haven't looked at my to-do list in a few hours. Actually, it's been, like, quite a few hours. Can't find my red pen that I was using to, like, mark things. Oh, it's gotten folded up. That's all right. So, I didn't... Oh, God, please tell me I did not just draw on that duvet. Nope, luckily nothing went on. I'm going to have to use my left hand for ticking because I'm not left-handed. So I did that assignment, that, that was a big one. I didn't tidy room in the sense of it's spotless, like it's not. And I didn't do anything to like my Sims 4 like next like episode type thing. But I definitely did drink more water at least more than usual because I might have only drunk a litre but that's definitely more than last week like the week previous like combined like I'm not joking <sighs> actually I might have drunk some water but it's more water in a day than previous so that is like the stuff I've done like I said I'm not doing any more work I'm currently watching a plant video from Kaylee Ellen just yeah so I'm watching YouTube I have got like the whole of Thursday off though so I've got Thursday to work on stuff but I think I'm gonna end the vlog 
here because anything I do now isn't going to be like interesting for like a vlog but I hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to watch another one of my videos and I hope you guys and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys